Boaz was wealthy and influential. According to Ruth chapter 2 verse 1, it says this, Now there was a wealthy and influential man in Bethlehem by the name of Boaz. Now that's the NLT translation. The NKJV says the same thing, but in different words. Which brings me to this. There's many Christian women that speak against wealth in connection to Christians, yet they say they want a Boaz. There's many Christian men that speak against wealth in connection with Christians, yet they say they want to be a Boaz. Do you guys read the Bible before you make these statements? My next point is this. Boaz is not the only wealthy servant that God has in the Bible. God made Job wealthy. God made Solomon wealthy. God made David wealthy. The rich man's tomb who Jesus was buried in, wealthy. Joanna, one of the most dedicated followers of Jesus, wealthy. So ponder all of that. Worshipping money is bad. Using it as a tool isn't. Follow for more content as such.